Mzururu TV. My name is Tembo Kahungu Misair. I am a journalist currently serving with the National Media Group, and that is the Daily Monitor. And uh, before that, I did quite a lot of work in uh, radio, locally in Kasese, where I grew up from. And um, unlike other journalists who will, who will rush for every new frequency that comes in the area, in my 13 and a half years in radio, I only served two radio stations. Radio Messiah, 10 years, uh, on two different uh, intervals, and then Kasesa Guide Radio, three and a half years. And I'm, a I'm very proud of these radios and what they did in my career. But at the same time, I taught at Liberty College of Management and Journalism for eight good years. And I know some of the journalists in Kasese can attest to this, that I was their tutor. And before coming to Monitor, I worked with Uganda Radio Network as a bureau chief for Vunyoro region, commanding seven districts. So uh, that is a simple introduction I can make about myself. Although my areas in journalism, I'm a political reporter. I also do oil, gas, and mining. And uh, I also do investigations. Yeah, it, it's so unfortunate that um, our generation is the one that is facing the most notorious uh, floods in the area. We've been told by the elders that uh, it has been happening over time, but uh, it seems the biggest damage has come at the moment. And uh, we can date it back to 1st May 2013. That's when the country was shocked with what happened in Kasese. When all the main rivers burst their banks at the same time, it was about 11 a.m. And it, it, it happened a week later. And then after one year it happened. And now it has been happening until we saw, I think, the most dangerous of all that has displaced thousands of people, which happened in May this year. So um, there are quite a number of factors, although we've not yet seen any scientific study that is made uh, to try to find out what might have been the cause. But to me, I feel that other causes of these floods are man-made. In, in other words, that we the people are doing what is not supposed to be done and the punishment we get are these disasters for example our human activities along the river banks you will find people have dug ports people are digging almost the last inch of the river uh, people are doing a lot of things upstream especially in the mountains where the the, the, the water comes from and therefore, by the time the levels of the water increase, the damage will always be too much because the valley is open. So when the water uh, floods over, when the, what we call the river has hit its bank, what happens is that it, it, uh, the water falls on a soft ground and will take everything that it does. Um, when the river Rubiriha burst its banks, because it was the last, towards June, that's when it, it, it happened. I went to, uh, to that place in Karambi Sabu County, and one elder told me that away from the human activities of cultivation and all that, but also the behavior. He says that people think that now they can make sacrifices in the middle of the river uh, in, in need for uh, wealth. And he thinks to him, uh, the gods, the gods are not happy. That's according to him. But to me, the, uh, the God in heaven is also not happy with the way the mankind in Kasese or in the Renzo region or elsewhere has misused 
the dominion over nature that you are given the world to rule over but you misuse it so it's it's a very dangerous situation that we are in and we need to rewind the way we do things we need to revive our respect for the rivers you don't need to 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 to, to wash in the river because we don't know whether you are washing menstrual blood in the river you don't need to defecate in the river you don't need to have sex in the river these are the things when we grew up we were being told when you do something evil in the river then the something will happen it can happen to you as an individual it can happen to the community so uh, that is one other thing but also i think we we've not uh, planted enough recommended trees in uh, along the river bank the trees all things like the bamboo that can hold the water so the the, the valleys are bare totally bare and when the the, the water fl flows at that rapid speed it goes with everything then we have cultivated we, we have we have constructed buildings along the river banks the population explosion in kasese is that everyone wants to have a piece of land that is his and therefore we end up whether it is uh, on the steep whether it's along the river bank so long as you can have what you call home and that's why you see many people getting displaced because of the floods ngandu ribira aba kaleba ya nzuru tv in the itwe tutwale tribuka atwa ko resource ama bible nyamanga mo bwati koko bana baye mwe buka hamatoera mwana sobola u er samadre ni mwalebya ngamwa ngamwa soberia hai e chana makubwira tirijiti twa tutire twa biri sobye generation yet obuli mudaka nda tungiri taka obuli mudaka ndiri himba so suli suli to mana olusinga lwalo kala bahanu wa maende kasese ukimsanga ne nyamwamba omate unye kasese ibute mashanzere shiringi sato so muyende ike huma huma erika haire sa henu wa mala ba delta utwe ka delta agatikati ka round about ne delta hani nzera ayo lusula lokala ba mne chilalu chine ewo hiko kwa delta nao hani nzera chilalu chine hu so utwe iko kwa nyamamba haire uko wa basanga ne chanzara sha yo haye wa mende mate unye chalumba ukensanga na mawe manene manene eba kubura mwanwe ne ebe nzera yo lusi ni beti twe ngabando twa twa mahambe itaka ri twa ti no it we are claiming this land so e she news nash is karonda ya shalaba neri bwa bi emetse idwe tukakule tukaiteriria no mo busi bunyo bunyo bukasende wetu mu chalo e baka kubura mbubu tsa subalo manusi botsa wani amo wa mabe uri mana obukali e wa berende wa songali botsa wa ya ndu manusi kutuka yo ere mensha nyimba shawe es es sha ber tsanda uwe mana wa bulu mena wa bukali simu kore butundire wa manusi kundi ebyo si mukabe here ndioka so ndioka ikende ro roma neri wasanga ne ebyo mayo committee yatuka kola yo musha koloma kana mbere karambe mali ndo libiri haloka filo musha ama mbere di ebya moyi hirire kunyamenya tu mutu mukoro ndo bugaga omunne ati ambata asa rembe ne hakatika tukolusi zende bana bugaga ni nyamka tu tetsebo ne chindi we situ chihongere shanyu sisietu twandire situ anzire e dini yabiri asa Betu wa Malebia na Madini ya Abraham bakahongera nyamahanga. Charikini wateka ari kana mala uwe ukoshangwe amula matriye abere bele tere hong nyamanga wati oke enda bwana ule matriye mburi area betu na mabe menya mutima wao. So ne ne eri eri amalambu ne ne bende bekata kwa ribi ebikakole bawa. Echini chu majo kwa bende betu tokolo o generation yetu batu heria met ai kamba mayete ne kamba kitakache tuchireke kolo chireke twika ngale ebu in the government nobody mudo so was ere ko sand but run the air mate it to can herayo yikini road to your colorful chain zuru tv